I am free. Praise the Lord, I am free. No longer bad. No more chains holding me. My soul is resting. It's just a blessing. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I'm free. Good morning. I am free. Praise the Lord. I am free. No longer bad. I ain't sang this song in a while. And no more chains holding me. My soul is resting. It's just a blessing. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I'm free. Good morning, saints. Good morning, people of the Most High God. Men and women of God. He who the sun sets free is free indeed. You know, he who the sun sets free is free indeed. If the sun sets you free, then you are free. If the Son of God sets you free, then you are free. That's when you can sing the freedom song. That's when you can walk in freedom. That's when you can be assured that your freedom is in Christ Jesus. My God. Good morning. God bless you in Canada, Montreal. God bless you. I know it's very early in certain parts of the world. You know, and sometimes on Sundays people sleep in, so that's fine. Those of us who can just, you know, come on early and just thank God for his goodness and his mercies towards us. Oh, God is wonderful. Listen to me. Whenever, you know, I'm, as, as you grow in the things of God, you begin to place emphasis on the word of God. Okay, when when you begin to see how you know uh, everything is panning out, you know, uh, I, I was singing that song, "I'm Free," and this scripture just jumped into my spirit. He who the sun sets free is free indeed. It's very ironic. It's very interesting that you know uh, that scripture. Or that text will be specific. He who the sun sets free is free indeed. If the son of God sets you free, or well, just now, it didn't say who the prophet sets free. It said he who the son sets free is free indeed. When the son sets you free, you're not bound to nobody. You're not tied up to anybody. It is the Son who has set you free. And you cannot put any price on the freedom that the Son gives you. My God, we bless His name. Oh, He's not dead. We know He died. Oh, we will never argue with you about that. We know He, he, he had to die. It's the Torah. He had to die. He had to die. But on the third day, he got himself back up. Oh, he died. There ain't no argument about that. He died. But he got himself back up. God is good, deserving all the glory and all the praise. My God, you came out of, you, you, you came out early. We ain't even prayed yet. That means it's going to be a blessed day for somebody. It's going to be a blessed day for prayer mantle. It's going to be a blessed time for prayer mantle. My God, today is going to be a wonderful day. Not only this day, the whole week is going to be blessed. Listen to me. We ain't been praying. Some people ain't been waking up yet. And we have interference. My God. Some of us ain't even waking up yet and we've already got interference. 
Yes, Lord. Somebody came to give us a revelation that Jesus is dead. We said, oh, yes, of course Jesus died. We know he died. We ain't going to argue with you about that. He had to die. Part of his mission was that he had to face death. You know why? Because the people that he was coming to rescue were bound up in sin and were candidates for death. That's you and I. I ain't excusing myself and I hope you didn't excuse yourself. See, the people that he was coming to rescue, my God, were bound up in sin and were candidates for this thing called death. And they couldn't pay for the debt that they had which was leading them into death. So what just now? He had to leave his kingly, his princely position. Came into agreement with his father. And said, Daddy, I feel like I need to put my robe down. I need to, you know, I need to, I need to go do some dirty work. My God. I need to do some dirty work. You know, I need to go put on this thing called flesh, which is, you know, dirt. You know, I've got to, I've got to smear myself with death. I need to take myself and place myself into this thing called dirt and become what you call a human being. Because the only way that I can qualify to deal with this mess that these people have found themselves in is I have got to be just like them. You know, I was praying before I came on the scope. Are you hearing me? I was praying before I came on the scope. I was praying before I came on the scope. And so, and so, don't be surprised by what is happening. See, so, so what happens is because he had to come and take my position. Because the Bible says that even on my best days, all my righteousness is as filthy rags. And so he had to come and take your position. He had to come and take my position. And so in order to qualify to do that, he had to wrap himself up in this thing called flesh, dirt, mess. And he had to stay in this uh, covering. about 33 years so that he can go through death so that he can be humiliated so that he can be spoken ill of so he can be laughed at so he can be mocked so he can be beaten up so he can be ostracized so that people would just look down on him and, and look and say look look at you Claiming that you're all this, claiming that you say sanctified with the Holy Ghost. You ain't got no money. Look at how bad you look. He had to go through everything that you and I will ever go through. So that you and I can stand today. So that when the enemy comes in like a flood, oh, we know the power that we possess. We know the authority that we have. We know the God that we serve. We know who our daddy and our father is. My God, isn't he a wonderful God? Isn't he an awesome God? Isn't he the everlasting father? Even he, isn't he the prince of peace? I just rose up this morning. Take a few minutes of your time. As some of you get ready to go to church. Oh, as some of you get ready to go give him some praise. Listen to me. We know who our father is. We know where we're going. My God, we know that we're passing through this life. Ah, waiting and biding our time because we want to be at peace with our father. He's the king of all kings and the lord of all lords. The Elohim, the bright and the morning star, the good God. He's our father. We love him because he first loved us. We will never know what real love is if he never expressed real love to us. He's our father and we love him. I said he's our father and we love him. He is God all by himself. 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 He's in the class of his own. He's in the class of his own. 
He is in a class of his own. Nothing can compare to him. Ain't no comparator. There is nothing that can stand in his presence. He is the Elohim. He is our Father. Come on, let's just, let's just let him know how much we love him on this blessed Sunday. Oh, let us express love to him. I want you to begin to make declarations of how much you love him. Father, we love you. We thank you. Father, if we look at how far you brought us, if we remember where we were before you found us, Father, we are so in awe of you. We're so grateful. We're so blessed, Father. We thank you. I thank you for my life. I thank you for my family. Thank you for my parents. Thank you for my grandparents. Thank you, Father God, for the life that you've given me. Thank you, God, for my wife. Thank you, God, for our house. Thank you for all that you're doing in our lives. Thank you for the ministry called Prayer Mantle that you've given to us. Thank you that, Father God, you laid your life for us. Thank you that, God, you are blessing us every day. Thank you that you are enlarging our coast. Thank you that you are enlarging our coast. Thank you that you are enlarging our coast. Thank you in the name of Jesus that, Father, you have continuously spread your wings in our lives. We thank you, God. We honor you. Jesus, we honor you. We thank you. Father, thank you for this prayer mantle family. Thank you for these great people. Thank you for these people that you have formed from yourself. Thank you for these people that you have anointed. Thank you for these people that you have touched. Thank you for these people that you have blessed. In the mighty name of Jesus, that God, you are allowing us to connect by virtue of prayer. We thank you, God. Oh, Father, we thank you. In the name of Jesus, we honor you. Father God, we elevate our minds and our thoughts. We say thank you for this house. Thank you for our vessels. Thank you for healing us. Thank you for giving us the peace of mind. Thank you for touching us. Thank you for laying your life down for us. Thank you that, Father, even when we disobeyed you, you still, oh, you still came through for us. Oh, some of us walked away from you. Some of us said some nasty things. Some of us didn't even think that you could do anything for us. But, Father, you still showed up. Father, in our mess, Father, when we're living in sin, Father, when we're bound up in addiction, all forms of addiction, all kinds of addiction, when we didn't know where to turn, Father, you made a way for us. 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 We thank you, God. Can we just say thank you, Holy Spirit? Thank you, Father. All I'm saying is thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. All I'm saying is thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. All I'm saying is thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. All I'm saying is thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. All I'm saying is thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my Lord. All I'm saying is thank you jesus thank you my lord thank you my lord and savior thank you jesus thank you for prayer mantle thank you for the saints thank you for the mothers in zion thank you for the authentic preachers thank you for the solid men and women of god that you release into our lives to be a blessing to us thank you for the prayer mantle farms thank you for the prayer mantle center Thank you for the prayer mantle conference. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father God. Thank you because you did it, Father God. Just for me, you did it. Just for me, you paid the price. Just for me, you healed me. Just for me, you delivered me. Just for me, you purged me. Just for me, you sanctified me. Just for me, God. I'm so thankful and grateful. I honor you. Jesus, I honor you. Jesus, I honor you. Jesus, I honor you in the name of Yeshua the Christ, the Son of the living God. God bless you. God bless you. Go have a blessed Sunday, okay? The Lord is with us. There is nothing. There is nothing I can fight. There is nothing I can hinder. In Jesus' precious name, have a blessed day. God, thank you. We love you. We appreciate you. We, we are grateful. In Jesus' mighty name, what a privilege and an honor to worship at your throne, to be called into your presence as your own. 
You are wonderful. You are worthy. You are awesome. You are God. Thank you. In Jesus' name. God bless you. Have a blessed Sunday. Go to church. Let the Lord be exalted in your life. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I'll see you tonight, okay? We'll come on tonight to pray. God bless you. Bye-bye. God bless you. Bye-bye. Lady McNeil, I haven't forgotten, okay? Email me, okay? God bless you. Bye-bye.